Okay. So, guys, where are we on our way to? Um, I'm gonna check my necklace. You're gonna check yeah. your necklace. Where are we on our way to? Where are we going? We're gonna get that to the beach. Oh, to the beach. To the beach. To the beach. Okay. So we're just leaving, we're about to leave Sprouts. We just picked up some snacks to go to the beach. It is what? A December day. And it's like, okay, you're buckled now. Good job. It's a December day and we're headed to the beach because it's super hot outside. Not only is it super hot, but it's super windy. I don't know if you can tell by um, the trees. How do I zoom in? You can't really tell right now. But it's super windy. I've already told the boys that if it's too windy when we get there, then we're gonna have to have a plan B. So we might end up at a park or something. It's crazy windy outside. And there's fires going on in LA. But it's really windy, which means that the fires are probably headed this way. I can actually smell fire. You can see all the wind. And actually you can see the smoke rising. So this is clear air, and this is all smoke coming, the fire coming. Okay, we made it to the beach. It's not as bad as I expected okay, it to be as far as the wind factor is concerned. The kids, what do you want me to do? Sunblock? Yeah. There's Raya. Can you hear the wind? There's a lot of birds there. Benaya, I need you to sit there while I set up, okay? Okay? Thank you, Boogie. Nope, you gotta sit. Nope, you're doing exactly the opposite. Okay. We used to play outside. Then you come around my way. And we used to go down the slide. When we used to jump off the swings. And we used to seek and we hide. Used to be around my way. It feel like back in the day. Yeah, feel like back in the day When we used to play outside When you come around my way And we used to go down the slide When we used to jump off the swings And we used to seek it hard Yeah, feel like back in the day When you come around my way I feel like I probably never have feelings like this The feelings like this I'm jumping through the ceiling like this If this is as good as it gets Then I'm chilling like this I feel the same between my toes In the village like this It takes a village to raise them And I ain't too proud to praise them And I ain't too lazy to bathe them This a part of just raising them Leave a raisin in the sun It'll probably a blazing But I raise them in the sun Cause it's godly amazement Planting seeds on the left coast Cause it's west side up when we were pulling up here with all, I had Anaya, I was wearing Anaya in the baby carrier and the boys were in the wagon and we had all of our stuff with us. This older gentleman saw us and he was like, wow, mama, you're brave. And I was like, yep. And he's like, but they're happy. And I was like, yep. <laughs> but the truth is, a lot of the times why I, why I will adventure out is because I'm realizing more and more in this stay-at-home mom journey that I need some vitamin D probably more than they do. Like, I know we both are in need of it, but I really need it. Like, when we get outside and we're doing stuff and I'm watching them have fun, I feel so much better than when we're cooped up in the house. So, any opportunity we have to get outside, we're gonna get outside. Right, Naya? Right, Naya? We're so dark in there, huh? Hi. Say hi. Hi. Yeah. Oh. Hi, I heard it. You said hi. Mom, we're gonna go in that slide. And then, and then that's why it's gonna be trapped. Trapped? We're going home. Say bye, beach. Bye, bye beach. beach. Excuse our dirty windshield. It's so crazy. I can't believe this. All right, I'm leaving.
Dude, I thought this fire was more up north. Now I'm really kind of concerned. What is going on here? It smells, huh? It smells like brownies? Mm -hmm. It does not smell like brownies. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. It smells like food. It's crazy. I should call Glenn. Hey. Yeah, they're um, it's coming down this way though. You know all the wind. It should be it should be pretty windy at the beach. It's windy over here now, so. Yeah, it's windy. It's just. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm in the house. I know, but do you smell smoke? Do you see fire? What's going yeah, on? Yeah, yes, it's fire. It's like. From LA. I know. I think it's more fires happening um, in like it looks like the Fallbrook area. Uh, Cause you can see the smoke coming up over like the um, the townhouses and stuff like that. But I don't. I think we're straight. Like I don't think it's gonna be as bad as it was last time, like 2008. Okay. Well, we're on our way home. Be on the lookout for us, just in case. Okay. All right. Love you. Love you too. Bye. Bye. <clears throat> Yo. <clears throat> last video some people were talking about how <clears throat> um you know i celebrate christmas and they, they thought i was conscious or how the christmas tree is like um a symbolism of um idolatry um you know because it does say that in scripture and and that you know christmas is a pagan holiday um you know which is basically rooted in people who believe in multiple gods or whatever um and like they're claiming i'm not conscious because I celebrate Christmas, you know, or, or buy a Christmas tree or whatever. Um, to those people, I would say, um, who cares? You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, I think, you know, we celebrate Christmas uh, because of the feels, you know, it gives us. We celebrate Christmas because, um, and I think we celebrate for different reasons, you know what I mean? I think I would celebrate it differently had I not have had kids, but because we have kids, I think, you know, for us, uh, we want to create, um, you know, a cool tradition, you know, um, but here's the big deal. Um, for someone who say like I'm insane or like um, I'm wrong for celebrating Christmas, um, the truth is, um, and, and you know, I'm not conscious. Uh, the truth is I'm way more conscious because I know what battles to choose. You know what I'm saying? And so um, if my wife wants to put up a Christmas tree um, on the freaking roof, I'm putting it up on the roof, not because she's right or uh, we're celebrating pagan holidays because it's my freaking wife and if she wants a Christmas tree on the roof, I'm putting a daggone thing on the roof because she's my wife. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, I, know, what, I know what battles to pick. I know that her family celebrates Christmas, my family celebrates Christmas, Christmas. Historically, I'm not gonna go against the grain when it's a time to bring people together. Christmas represents uh, Christmas represents uh, in our culture today what people are supposed to have throughout their entire year. So if people want to be filled with the spirit, uh, the Christmas spirit, um, and be very giving during this time of the year, that's all fine. That's that's positivity for me. You know what I'm saying? Um, if they're gonna be, uh, you know, a, a Christian, someone who has, is a believer, you know what I'm saying, should have joy like that of Christmas all throughout the year in every freaking day and every moment. You know what I'm saying? I know we have our downfalls, but we should always be giving and joyous. You know what I'm saying? The delight in the fact that we have the Holy Spirit. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not gonna like sit up here and like argue with people about whether Christmas is a pagan holiday. Like we understand that it's rooted in paganism, uh, but it, it really doesn't matter in the grand scheme of things because um, we are conscious people. I'm very woke in these streets. I'm fighting for um, the ministry of reconciliation, you know what I'm saying, which I believe I have as a, as a child of God, which means that I'm reconciling men and, and women and, and people together and I'm reconciling them back to God, you know what I'm saying? Like, So I'm not really like into the arguing about 
the pagan holiday, I'm just saying, like, if any of you wondering why we choose to celebrate it, it's just because I choose to ch pick my battles, you know? And um, if Christmas is the time that brings people together, then it's just the time that brings people together, you know what I'm saying? And I'm not gonna make a big deal out of it. So, uh, respect. I feel like back in the day when we used to play outside, when you come around my way, and we used to go down the slide. We used to jump off the swings And we used to seek and we hide Used to be around my wife Feel like back in the day Yeah, feel like back in the day When we used to play out I feel like I probably never have feelings like this The feelings like this I'm jumping through the ceiling like this If this is as good as it gets Then I'm chilling like this If there was <clears throat> Yo, shout out to Pat Jr. who sent me this beat um, making this while the laundry is playing right now because it's not a game uh, but I, I got inspired and I was like let me just throw this under here and let me make this track real quick um, if you feel the track go ahead and hop on patreon and it'll be there for you to listen to download or whatever